Hi beautiful people, another day in a world of technology and I have discovered an effective piece of equipment which I'm sure everyone except me knows about. Clearly I have been living under a rock until now I can see the light. <laughs> I have always used the regular mouse but the upgrade to a triathlon multi wireless mouse has been much better. At first I was very confused about what those extra buttons can do and of course I had to find out. There are three extra buttons and we are allowed to customize two of them and of course the usual buttons that come on a regular mouse. First you need to check that your iPad software is over the number 13. This level of software supports the wireless mouse Click touch, then assistive touch, choose devices and click the name of the mouse you are using and here are the options for each button. Finally, let's get to customization. For button number one, because I'm using my dual control, which selects everything for me, my button one, I want secondary click. And then I just go back. For button two, I want my app switcher. As you can see, there are plenty of options to choose from to customize each button. The list is very long. I go back and select button 3 and I choose my dock. Button 4, screenshot. And lastly, button 5, which is to restart my iPad. And I will explain why I chose all of these. And I'm sure that you will also find it very, very helpful for you. For button 5, I chose restart. Because I have a cover on my iPad, it is hard for me to press down the power off button. Now let's test it. So for the first one, I can just click on any of my apps and button one is my secondary click, which gives me extra options for any of my apps on my iPad. If I click button two, which is over here, I have my app switcher, where I can see all of my opened apps and I can work between them. When using a mouse and I am on any of my apps, it's actually hard to reveal my dock. So for button 3, I actually chose dock because when I am on my safari 
as you can see while I am browsing and if I need to use my dock it's actually a bit of a struggle to reveal I just have to press button 3 and my dock appears for button 4 I chose screenshot So now all I do is I press my fifth button and instantly I am asked if I need to restart my iPad. You can still use touch on your iPad when your mouse is active. Thank you for watching and I'm off.